हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू क्विक पोइट्री नॉलेज दिस इज योर हॉस्टिस महजुबीन टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन इंग्लिश पोएट रॉबर्ट साउथ हीज पोएम द स्कॉलर दिस पोएम इज ऑल्सो ऑल्टरनेटिवली टाइटल्ड एज माय डेज अमंग द डेड आर पास्ट माय डेज अमंग द डेड आर पास्ट सो द पोएट इज सेइंग दैट ही इज पासिंग हिज डेज in the company of dead people in the company of the authors who have written great books but those authors are no more so he he has a a vast a big library and uh, he spends it is understood from the poem that he spends most of his time reading the books of those people who are no longer alive my days among the dead are past around me i behold and whenever he takes a cursory glance around him when he takes a look at all the books uh, around him wherever these casual eyes are cast when he looks around him in a casual way the mighty uh, uh, wherever these casual eye, eyes are cast the mighty minds of old he sees the mighty that is the uh, scholarly minds of the old of the old or the scholarly minds of the people who are no longer alive my never failing friends are there and, and these are the friends that are with him at all time because he is reading their books all the time and he is getting tremendous amount of knowledge and information uh, that uh, by reading those books and as a result the writers the authors who have written these books they are his constant friends they are his constant companions never failing friends are they with whom i converse day by day and with these authors with these writers he interacts on a daily basis because he is reading their books all the time with them i take delight in weal and he says that whenever he is happy he shares the happiness in the company of um in the company of these dead writers and seek relief in wu and whenever he is sad when he, whenever he is distressed he reads the the books that has been left behind by these great authors and he learns how to overcome his sadness and seek relief in wu wu means sadness and relief means comfort and while i understand and feel how much to them i owe and he says that i a low i owe a lot to these people i uh, i am very grateful to these people for giving me inspiration my cheeks have often been bedewed with thoughts of with tears of thought, thoughtful gratitude and every time and every time i think about how much they have helped me through the ups and downs of my life how much of direction how much of guidance i have received from these interesting books that they have left behind i whenever i thought about them these authors tears would flow down my cheeks with tears of thoughtful gratitude and these would be tears that would express my gratitude to these people who are no longer alive because they are the people who have shared their happiness in their books these are the people who have shared their sadness in these books and both the happiness and the sadness that have been expressed by the various writers in these books have given some kind of inspiration or the or the other to the poet and that is why he is grateful to these writers my thoughts are with the dead so he says that he is continuously thinking about those dead authors he thinks about them all the time because he is reading their books all the time with them i live in long past years and because he is immersed in their books most of the time he it seems as though he is living with them in the past in the time in the time when these people were alive he he seems to be uh, living their lives their virtues love and as a as a result he has learned to admire their virtues or their good qualities and their faults condemn 
and he criticizes and he criticizes their faults their mistakes the mistakes or the errors that they had made in their lives partake their hopes and fears and he also shares their hopes and fears and he also feels afraid every time these writers and authors have expressed their fears and insecurities in their writings he would also feel afraid to read those sections and every time the writers had expressed uh, their hopes and aspirations he would also feel hopeful about their future and from their lessons seek and find instruction with an humble mind so he says that from the lessons that they have left behind in their books he gets inspiration guidance um, about how he should live his life and from their lessons seek he searches for those inspiration he looks for inspiration he looks for guidance <coughs> and accordingly he gets them and apart from their from their lessons and from their lessons seek and find instruction means inspiration with an humble mind that means with a sober mind he he is receptive of all kinds of um information that he gets about living a good life my hopes are with the dead and none and he says that my hopes are also with the dead people because but uh, the dead people are no longer uh, alive they are gone from this world and while writing they had expressed their hopes and similarly when i read their books i do feel hopeful about my future my hopes are with the dead and and on my place with them will be and very soon i will also be gone from this world because uh, i know for uh, for certain i'm i'm sure that i'm also not going to live for uh, live on forever and and on very soon my place with them will be i will also be occupying a place uh, somewhere near their graves and i with them shall travel on through all futurity and just as they are resting in their graves now and this kind of rest will go on forever and ever i too once i die i will be, start my resting period for ever and ever and with these uh, soul mates of mine i will continue the rest of my journey as a dead person and with them shall travel on through all futurity yet leaving here a name i trust and yet at the same time i hope that i will be leaving behind my name i trust means i hope that will not perish in the dust i hope that the uh, the people whom i leave behind they will read my books just as i have uh, read so many books of the dead writers other people will also read my books and they will remember me long after i am gone yet leaving here a name i trust that will not perish i uh, this is the hope that i have that after i am gone my name will be remembered it will not perish in the dust well that's all for today i will be uploading the summary of this poem very soon do consider subscribing if you appreciate this kind of content bye